All right, hello everybody. I'm just going to uh, walk you through one of my games here that I had on the free internet chess server. We're going to go through uh, move by move. You're definitely going to see some mistakes, but there was some uh, good play to be had here. Is um, basically trying to get better at the game as we go. So uh, I'm black, uh, J. Roby, and uh, standard opening here. Usually what I do is I try to get these pieces in play um, to, uh, if need be, replace the center pawns. I like to try to hold the center. Here's where I, I felt at this point I was starting to lose some tempo here. I had to retreat my knight. Now, generally, I'm not a big fan of doing this. I don't like to have this here. It blocks my bishop and just basically tightens things up. I would say right now, positionally, I'm, I'm behind. So basically, my thoughts here is I need to start breaking some pieces out. And I'm trying to do something with this pawn here as the game progresses. As you can see, my opponent just castled, and I can't do that. So he's putting pressure on my bishop here. Um, I opt to just take the knight and relieve the pressure off of the uh, area here. He's putting pressure on my knight there. And I put him in check there. Now, basically I was just trading for the bishop. Getting some play here. This pawn is still a problem. Trying to flex things out a little bit here. Okay, put some pressure on his queen. Obviously, he moves it. Now it's letting me jiggle the bottom pieces around a little bit here. Okay, we, he goes for a queen trade. I graciously accept. And he uh, comes a little bit ahead of material there. Now, it starts to get a little bit interesting around this point in the game here. Um, I still believe that I'm quite a bit uh, uh, behind in terms of uh, position. And now you can see he's got some very tangible threats on my king, who has never been able to castle this game. So, but thankfully I had this little pawn here. So I put his king to check and take his rook for a pawn. Even sings out a little bit. There's still a lot of pressure going on here. Okay, I want to get that knight moving a little bit. Yep, put my king there. Now here he makes an interesting move. He moves his pawn up one. Um, to me, this is a crucial move that helped turn the game around for me. I'm just going to trade the rooks. Because I'll be one rook ahead, uh, rook against knight. I have a better pawn structure. You can tell that the pawns are blocked here. And uh, this knight's not much of a threat. You have to position him a uh, few moves to get him any kind of real thing going with him. Uh, and that's what you see he'll try to do here. But my pawn structure over here is quite a bit superior. And with a rook, it just makes for a, a fairly uh, straightforward game here. I take, he takes, move up, he moves down. Up, king moves over, slide the rook over, take the pawn, and march the pawn up to become a queen. As you can see, he's trying to get his knight into a better position here, uh, but it's too late. He concedes at this point. So this is the first uh, first video I'm putting here on YouTube of uh, my chess games. I'm rated, uh, well, 817 right now as of this video for Blitz, and I think 15-something for Standard. I'm um, just starting to get really serious about the game and, and just trying to learn and and uh, do some reading and, and things like that. So I hope you enjoy the videos as they come and uh, definitely welcome any feedback, positive or negative. I can uh, definitely use help.